currently a theory. Coach Miller Light's on the scene. So the theory is that it's all a theory. I'm noticing in life that as I'm studying universal law, conversations with God, book one, that's what I was listening to today, writing down passages from it, writing down words that were being said in this audiobook, word for word, with the idea of tuning myself to that frequency. It's a feel-good frequency. It's a frequency of solutions. It has every answer I'm seeking. It, it makes everything right. When I follow the instructions in Conversations with God, book one. So the theory is that it's all a theory. I'm moving myself. I'm trying. I'm working towards the attitude in life of it's all a theory. I don't know anything. Instead of being on my pedestal and knowing stuff because that's when I don't feel good. That's when I end up falling down because I'm up too high, coming on down and playing from a place of here's what I'm studying. Here's what the math on the board says, you know, my glad scientist laboratory board. Here's what I'm coming to and I'm just going to study it, try it out and notice how it goes. Be a scientist, a glad scientist. All right, so I wrote some down, down today, some very powerful things. This is about gratitude, right? Gratitude, I hear about it. I hear about it. It's all around gratitude, thanksgiving. It's the way to go. It's the most powerful statement. Conversations with God has a very dynamic way of stating this. Here's what I wrote, word for word. The correct prayer is therefore never a prayer of supplication but a prayer of gratitude. When you thank God in advance for that which you choose to experience in your reality, you in effect acknowledge that it is there in effect. Thankfulness is thus the most powerful statement to the Almighty. An affirmation that even before I ask, I am has answered. Never supplicate, therefore appreciate. Gratitude cannot be used as a tool with which to manipulate the universe, a device with which to fool God. You cannot lie to yourself. The mind knows the truth of your thoughts. If you're saying, thank you God for such and such, all the while being very clear that it isn't there in your present reality, you can't expect the divine isness to be less clear than you and so produce it for you. All that is knows what you know, and what you know is what appears as your reality. All right, well, let's back up here, because there's point after point after point that I choose to apply in my life. This sounds powerful. All right, so gratitude, right? So the difference is, am I supplicating? Am I saying, please, right? Because I pray, I pray, I love to pray. Sister Pierre told me, you know, Catholic high school, uh, grade school I went to, St. Teresa of Avila. Sister Pierre told me that a song is worth three prayers. Yeah, hallelujah. I like that, Matt. Prayer. And what Conversations with God is saying is that all thought is prayer. And all thought, all prayer is answered. So we'll get to that coming up here. Okay, so the most powerful prayer is a prayer of gratitude, not supplicating. All right, and I can see the difference. I can actually feel the difference when I'm praying and I'm, and I'm like, oh, please, you know, you know that prayer? Rather being, thank you, thank you, thank you, almighty, thank you. Thank you for already producing this outcome. This is what it's saying. It's thankfulness is the most powerful statement to source energy and affirmation that even before you ask, I have answered. How, how fantastic. Not only have I answered, but before you asked. So I'm understanding this well, as I'm coming to understand it from a, a standpoint of today's technology, is that it's all already on the disc, DVD. DVD is even kind of old school, right? Who has a DVD player anymore, right? But it's a, a concept I understand. So this DVD has all the information on it all already on there and then I the viewer can scene select that's how I'm understanding this to be and I really appreciate and like that idea that everything that I'm choosing in my life that I could be praying for is an outcome 
that is already available on the divine disk drive. It's already on the universal hard drive. It's on there. And now my affirmation of appreciation, my thankfulness, actually attracts it to me like a magnet. Pretty neat idea. Something that I choose to try out, work with, see how it goes, to use it in my own laboratory of life. Okay, how does it go when I'm like wanting it, right? Coming from supplication, it's calling it. I notice that supplication will bring me through and I'll end up appreciating, but couldn't I skip steps? Couldn't I warp here to the higher level of appreciation? Appreciation, appreciate, to increase in value. So it says this powerful statement here is that you cannot lie to yourself. Welcome, Coach Amelia Nine. What's going on here? This is currently a theory is with that? Coach Miller Light, yeah. Oh, oh, you you have a show. Yeah. Oh, well, thanks for having me on. Thank you for being I here. I was backstage and I heard all this excitement out here and I said, I better get out there. Okay. What's the big topic today? Sounds so good. The topic is, instead of supplicating, appreciate. Oh, yeah. I was just talking about this today. Okay. Appreciation equals to increase in value. Yes. That's what you're doing. True. You're increasing in value. <laughs> True. Well, you totally sound like you got this all handled. All right. All right. Thanks for having me on. Well, thanks for being here. <laughs> that was awesome. Coach A Million Nine, he has this amazing playlist over on Hope Skyrockets, one of my favorite YouTube channels. There's this playlist called Vlog A Million, which I've been binging on. I listen to it as I'm getting ready each day, you know, showering and getting ready. I realize, I'm noticing that those, those times are important, what I have in the airwaves when I play Vlog a million. So I've been going down the playlist. There's 73 Vlogs in this playlist and they are all equally insightful and hilarious. So much fun comedy on there. It's such a great angle that I really, really love and appreciate. So thank you Coach Million Nine for coming on the show today. All right, so we're gonna be wrapping it up here with this, this decision to appreciate, right? Practicing it, using it like Anything that I get good at, I, I practice and I try to be good at it. I put energy and effort into it. So who cares if I'm not really a good appreciator yet? If I notice, I start to notice that I'm really not very grateful. I can start to be and I can practice gratitude, practice appreciation. Look at it in this manner of this is a skill and I'm going to be great at this skill. Why? Because conversations with God says it's the most powerful statement we can make to the Almighty. A statement of appreciation, of thanksgiving, of gratitude. All right, till next time, this is Coach Miller Light, thanking you for being here.